Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Renaissance Rocha. In today's video, we're going to pick up where we dropped off Mello's new girlfriend. <laughs> Come along for the ride as we journey up north to Ulitonio where we will play Epo. But first, let's roll the intro. Continuing our journey, we made our way along the Totten River, which separates Finland and Sweden. We were met with some beautiful views of the rolling hills painted by the autumn leaves changing colors. I've been on many bus trips in my day playing hockey, but I must say, this is one of my favorites. Etbo's Arena is located atop a hill nestled in the trees. I would have to say this is one of the most remote rinks I've ever played in. Playing an away game after a long road trip isn't always easy, but it's something you have to get used to. After getting off the bus and unloading our gear, it's time to get ready to play. Here at the Cowboys, we are lucky enough to have amazing staff that help us get everything ready before a game. Thank you, Ronnie. One of the most challenging parts about an away game is making the uncomfortable feel comfortable. And these guys really facilitate that for us. So Leo, luck off. Here's a quick look at our setup on the road. As you can see, it's a little messy, but when you have a game to play, it can't always be pretty. Before every game, we usually like to start off with a quick warm-up game of two-touch, which is also referred to as sewer, or swala, also translating to salt. Don't ask, there's a lot of names for these things. No! As you, as you can see, Pelzi is very good at this game in the office. This is me ways. helping our equipment manager, Roni, learn how to juggle. Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> Ten minutes. <laughs> I guess I should go get dressed now. The game is starting soon. So here we are getting ready, getting our jerseys on. And now we're going to introduce the team. Up first, we got our goalie, Mule, our coach, Hecky. We got our boy, Tommy here. Mika, we got Jesse, Rauzi, Ate, Anton, Ville, we got Ere, Melo's new close friend, oh yeah, we got Matthias, Bono, Pelzi, we got Veti, Miksu, we got Captain Jonas, our boy Melo, that's me right there. Oh yeah, nice little fist bump. And of course, we got Tito. Let's get this game underway. Unfortunately, the league cameras weren't operational this game. However, Potty did manage to get some footage with the GoPro. We started off slow in the first and they scored two quick goals. We got our legs moving and picked things up a little better in the second. While they scored another to make it 3-0, we came back with a goal from Ede. Going into the third, still down by two, things didn't get much better as they scored another to seal the deal. After a disappointing game, we packed up the bus and made our way south to get ready for our next game. When we arrived in Torneo, we stopped by the rink to unload our bags and get things all set up for the next game.
then arrived at the hotel so we could check into our rooms. Have fun in the bunk bed, Mello. Mello, Muley, and I were supposed to be sharing a room tonight. But first, we had to find the room with three beds in it. No. No. This is your beautiful. Okay. Wrong room. Up another set of stairs, no. Of course, he's taking the elevator for one flight, really? I mean, you can walk. I will walk. You know? There's no bunk bed here either. <laughs> How many beds? Two. 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 What the f? Terrace, wrong room. Hmm. Somebody's got a bunk bed. Well, Molly, I guess you get the carpet. I eat that candy. That's <laughs> <laughs> I lose my friends. I don't know where's my room. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where's my room. It's all No, it's. Really, Mellow, you're having chips? <laughs> oh, there's your bed, Mellow. I'm not. I mean, is there like at least a couch somewhere? Leather couch. Ooh, Mellow. Casting couch. Alright, who's doing the interview? <laughs> so I guess we're not going to bed yet? I don't know. One extra room. I'll take it. I'll stop with swarming right. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's up to them. If you don't know, if you don't want to be stuck with us. How do I always end up getting stuck with you? All the time. I mean, I'm going to assume it's because we're the only two Canadians. <laughs> and he's older than us. So seniority. Let's go to the sauna. Yeah. yeah. Knock on our door when you're ready. Yeah. See ya. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you hang out with Mellow for two minutes and you're already forgetting stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mellow. You know what, dude? Okay, Mellow. I will knock on the door. Alright, we'll be ready like right yeah. away. See Sounds ya. Good. Well, Mellow, looks like it's me and you again in another little hotel room. Somehow we always get stuck together. Let's do a uh, hotel room tour. We have yeah. our mini can fridge. I get, can I get changed first? What? I thought this was the after hour show. Pow. <laughs> the couch is over there. Mellow's bed. Mellow's junk food. Mellow's junk food. My food. <laughs> my bed. That's my stuff. That's your stuff. Yeah, why, why is your stuff, stuff there? Yeah, leave me. Take that Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it up here. Okay, Mellow's side of the room. And then my side of the room. Yeah. Thank you. My water. <laughs> my pregame. Mellow's pregame. Mellow. Wolf. Artwork in our room, Mel. Look how nice that is. Look at this. Beautiful. Go. Let's get to bed early and have a good day tomorrow. What was the Bible in there for you? For me, it's for you. Usti, Usi Testamenti. Yeah, I think so. I believe it's some sort of Bible. I don't know. Yeah. Mel's well, gonna get close with God tonight. <laughs> Always. <laughs> As always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you at our next game in Torneo.